Digital Radio Mondial is radio reimagined for all. Digital Radio Mondial, or DRM, is part of digital communications worldwide. DRM is designed as a high-quality digital replacement for analogue radio broadcasting. With the DRM Digital Radio Standard, the existing radio infrastructure can be modernised to offer listeners so much more. With some investment, DRM offers vast benefits, for example, much richer and better content for everybody using less energy. Digital Radio Mondial offers digital radio for all. So how can we digitise a whole country with DRM? Let's imagine a country called Integria, with cities and villages, mountains and deserts. This imaginary country, maybe a bit like yours, has 25 million inhabitants. Digitalia, its capital of 6 million people, is a trading and banking centre. There are also two other medium-sized cities in the west, some semi-autonomous townships in the south, and a great forest region dividing the country in two. Agriculture is important and the rural population is spread over large areas. Integria, this medium-sized country with a limited GDP, has many communication challenges. How to provide news, information, entertainment and education to the whole of the population. How to warn people of dangers and disasters, be they man-made or natural. Currently, Integria has an integrated radio broadcasting network using shortwave, medium wave and FM transmissions, which can be received by most people in many, but not all areas of the country. The public service broadcaster, called National Radio NR, uses one old shortwave transmitter and three medium wave transmitters that cover mainly rural areas. In the cities, low power but expensive FM stations deliver a mixture of news and travel content in several languages and dialects, but their signal does not travel far beyond the city limits. So FM covers about 15% of the population and medium wave 80%, while villages in the Great Forest region do not get any coverage. However, people in rural areas would like more radio in local languages for more hours in the day. DRM is the only digital radio system that embraces all all the currently used radio frequency bands and can help improve the radio services for Integria. DRM can offer full national and international coverage to Integria's public broadcaster. DRM can offer services to smaller community stations for the needs of local listeners in small cities and villages. DRM allows the broadcaster to transmit up to three different radio broadcasts from one single transmitter. So you could have a greater variety of radio content. So what's the plan to migrate the current analogue system to digital in Integria? One option is to establish or upgrade to DRM the existing shortwave transmitter covering the whole of Integria to include the capital, the cities, the townships, the Great Forest, each rural area from one secure location. This means national radio programmes and emergency notifications can now reach everyone. A second additional option is to establish or upgrade the existing medium wave transmitters just for regional coverage. Each of these transmitters can carry up to three radio broadcasts, so the content can be richer, more varied and in the regional languages or dialects. A medium wave transmitter switched over to DRM provides the same coverage but using up to 50% less power than analogue. That's a lot of energy savings. A further option is to digitise the FM radio stations in the capital. And in other parts of the country, the FM stations, commercial or state funded, could also benefit from DRM. More content in more languages on flexible DRM for all. All these three digitisation scenarios can be scheduled and combined in order to reach all of the citizens of Integria. Let's look at the extra benefits of DRM. While it's not just audio, DRM radios also have a screen and DRM can provide data along with the audio broadcasts, 
Data means text and pictures, from maps to maths lessons, live sports results in different languages, and emergency warnings in case of disasters. DRM provides an opportunity for digital radio station managers to use this data channel to create a new revenue stream. In summary, Digital Radio Mondial, DRM, is flexible, green and delivers universal access to information so the whole country can be connected. And every pupil and student of Integria can be provided with education, even in the remote areas with no internet access. With more radio broadcasts, there are opportunities for more jobs. Emergency broadcasts can also be regionalised and transmitted from safe areas only to the affected zone or locality. Good morning, you're listening to NR1. The government are asking the residents of South Haven to stay indoors. In a national emergency, the DRM local, regional and national broadcasting network allows the government to alert and talk to all the Integria citizens during any kind of disaster as they have an emergency channel available at a moment's notice. Integria can now benefit from the reinvention of radio and enjoy excellent sound quality for small or large area broadcasting with country-wide coverage. Up to three times as many broadcasts using the same transmission infrastructure. 50 to 90% transmitter energy savings depending on the transmission infrastructure. A text and picture service by radio which helps with general information and education. A national emergency warning feature that can be used at the flick of a switch. A new receiver industry and extra jobs in broadcasting and manufacturing. So what are the key steps to successfully rolling out digital radio in Integria or your own country? To enjoy superior digital radio for all, a regulatory framework is required. The government needs to promote digitisation publicly and actively let broadcasters know when digital frequency licences will be available and when the digital services will be launched. Regulators, broadcasters, receiver manufacturers and retailers need to work together from the start of the digital radio project. Remember, digital broadcasts cannot be heard using analogue receivers. Nearer to the digital radio launch date, there needs to be a public awareness campaign, especially in remote areas. The government could consider subsidising new receivers so that their prices are as low as possible. The government could also request and receive grants and funding from international organisations. DRM encourages a homegrown radio manufacturing industry. There's no reason why local manufacturers couldn't develop DRM digital radios for Integria. It doesn't matter whether manufacturers want to make standalone radios, retrofit receivers in old cars, or add them to brand new vehicles. DRM is an open standard, available to anybody. Listeners are the ultimate beneficiaries in a successful rollout of digital radio. DRM technology enables great and rich content and can save lives. DRM is radio reimagined for the benefit of all.